Welcome back viewers. In today's video, we'll discuss a common condition called edema and share six effective ways to shrink swollen feet and ankles. Edema occurs when there is a buildup of fluid in the tissues of your feet, legs, or ankles, and sometimes even in the arms and hands. The signs of edema include pitting, which causes puffiness around your feet. When you press into it with your finger, it leaves a dent or dimple. You may also experience a feeling of heaviness in your lower legs or feet, which can be sore or painful to walk on. The skin may feel tight, warm, and appear stretched or shiny due to the swelling and bulging. Swelling in the feet or ankles can be caused by various factors, such as poor blood circulation, a deficiency in vitamin B1 or potassium, fatty liver, heart problems, medications, or even pregnancy. Fortunately, there are natural remedies and simple things you can do at home to reduce this excess fluid and alleviate the swelling. Before we dive into the remedies, it's important to note that this video is for educational purposes only. If you have any medical concerns, please consult with your doctor. Number 1. Serapeptase one effective remedy is taking a supplement called Serapeptase, 100,000 SBU, daily. Serapeptase is a powerful enzyme produced by silkworms. When taken as a supplement, it helps dissolve scar tissue and blood clots in the arteries, heart, liver, and kidneys, improving blood circulation to and from your feet. This natural process helps mobilize the extra fluid trapped in your feet, reducing aching, pain, and soreness. Number 2. Potassium Vegetables If pressing your finger into your ankle or foot leaves a small dimple or dent, known as pitting edema, it indicates fluid retention. Refined carbohydrates, such as sugar, soda drinks, sweets, breads, and pastries, can cause your body to store too much water outside your cells. This results in difficulty moving fluid in and out of your cells, leading to pooling around your feet. To reduce swelling in your feet and ankles, cut down on refined foods and increase your intake of potassium-rich vegetables. Avocados, beet tops, Brussels sprouts, collard greens, arugula, squash, bok choy, tomatoes, zucchini, broccoli, and leafy green vegetables are excellent choices. The potassium in these foods helps lower inflammation and swelling in your heart, liver, kidneys, and circulatory system, allowing the fluid to move where it needs to be. Number 3. Dandelion Leaf Tea Dandelion leaf tea is a powerful natural diuretic that helps release excess fluid from your body, reducing swelling. Prepare the tea by infusing 2 teaspoons of dried dandelion leaves or a quarter cup of fresh dandelion leaves in 1 cup of boiling water. Let it steep for 5 to 10 minutes, strain, and drink it 2 to 3 times a day. Dandelion leaf tea also supports your liver which can be beneficial if your swelling is related to a fatty or damaged liver. Number 4. Nutritional Yeast, B1 Consuming 2 to 3 tablespoons of unfortified nutritional yeast daily can help balance blood sugar levels, reduce swelling, and improve circulation to your feet. Nutritional yeast is rich in B vitamins, especially vitamin B1, which is essential for maintaining fluid balance in your heart, liver, and muscles. Adding nutritional yeast to your salads, soups, stir-fries, yogurts, and other dishes can provide your body with more B1. Additionally, including garlic, organic pork, wild salmon, and sunflower seeds in your diet can help boost your B1 intake. Number 5. Exercise Regular exercise plays a significant role in improving circulation. Since the feet are the furthest extremities from your heart, it requires extra effort to pump bodily fluids back up. Moving around more, especially if you have a desk job, can help. Take five-minute breaks every hour, stand up, walk around, and get some fresh air. 
Engaging in activities like walking, swimming, or biking at least twice a week will strengthen the tone of your veins, allowing blood to flow freely and reducing excess fluid retention. Number 6 Cypress Oil Massage Manual massage techniques can help push out the fluid trapped in your swollen feet and ankles. Gently massage and stroke the affected area towards your heart using firm yet gentle pressure. You can perform the massage yourself or ask a family member for assistance. Certain essential oils, such as cypress oil, cedar oil, have anti-inflammatory properties that can absorb into the skin. Dilute a few drops of your chosen oil in coconut oil and use it to massage the skin gently. These six methods, when combined, can effectively reduce swelling in your ankles and feet by addressing the underlying causes. Remember to implement them alongside a healthy diet, with a focus on cutting out sugar and refined foods, as these often contribute to the main underlying cause of edema. Before we conclude, here are a few additional tips that can aid in draining fluid from your feet. Lemon water, if liver problems are causing your swollen feet, start drinking freshly squeezed lemon juice in water daily to cleanse your liver and improve blood circulation. Parsley. Adding fresh parsley to your salads can act as another powerful diuretic to reduce swelling in various parts of the body. Epsom foot soak. If you're pregnant, overweight, or standing on your feet all day, inflammation in your legs and feet may result. Soak your feet in a bucket of hot water containing Epsom salts each night to improve circulation and reduce inflammation. Potassium Citrate Powder If you have diabetes or blood sugar problems, consider taking 1,000 to 2,000 mg of potassium citrate in water daily. This will further boost your potassium levels, reducing sodium retention and facilitating fluid movement in and out of your cells. To summarize, here are the 10 things you can do to shrink your swollen feet and ankles. Take 100,000 SPU of serapeptase daily. Eat potassium-rich vegetables to reduce sodium and water retention. Drink 2-3 to three cups of dandelion leaf tea per day. Include nutritional yeast in your diet for vitamin B1. Move your body and exercise more for better circulation. Massage the swollen area with cypress oil to release trapped fluid back to the heart. Drink lemon water for a cleaner liver. Eat more parsley. Soak your feet in Epsom salts and hot water. Drink potassium citrate powder. That wraps up today's video. If you found this information helpful, please hit the like button, subscribe, and turn on notifications to stay updated with my latest health and nutrition tips. Thank you for watching, and as always, I wish you great health, wealth, and happiness.